perfect old Christmas tree. Bunch of sap. It's awesome. What's up, everybody? James Showers here. You're on the No Man King channel, and what is today? Today is the reboot of a series called Home Free RV. I don't know if that's what I'm gonna call it or not, but I always like that name for some reason. So this is like a Home Free RV vlog. Um, day one, or episode one. I'm probably not gonna do daily vlogs. It's a little too much, so I'll probably mix a little bit of what I got going on during the week and throw it in here. So. What we've done, just so you catch up, because like I think I'm gonna upload some kind of like introduction or some kind of like intro into this life or some kind of something. So that'll be a separate video, and this will be the actual like first episode of um, the vehicle dwelling. So as right now, I'm vehicle dwelling, so I'm not really RVing. My trailer, uh, my home, uh, my 25 foot trailer is in Idaho still. So um, what I'm doing is I'm vehicle dwelling. And uh, what's kind of cool is I came all the way to Kirkland um, to go to the office to get, um, you know, let me start. I went to Kirkland first. The office that I'm going to go work for is out there. So I went out there this morning after I stayed in Kirkland. And uh, the job I'm working on is basically right here in Bellevue, Queen Anne. So I'm like, dude, this is my old stomping grounds. <laughs> no, I, I used to do a little RV vlog um, that I deleted a long time ago because I, I, it was just kind of stupid. But uh, this one's going to be good for, for real. But uh, I used to pull the travel trailer and, um, and live in that on these streets. But we're going to do something different in this series. Right now, obviously, we're starting out as a vehicle dweller. And then we're going to work our way up. And there's a few other little surprises that are going to be coming a few months down the line. So hopefully this will just develop into a really cool series. Um, and like always, comment down below. Let me know what you think. Um, <clears throat> yeah. And I don't know if I'm posting this before a work vlog goes up. But there will probably be a separation between like these like RV vlogs where I'm actually just roaming around doing whatever. And then an actual like work vlog, which I'll probably do like a little bit of um, some video of work going to work something going on at work and then that'll be a week will be um, a video for the weekend so all right now that that's all out of the way it's basically a channel update episode one channel update I don't even know what's going on okay but what do we need to do oh we're still not even telling this we're not even done telling the story so the jobs over here in Ballard old stomping grounds whatever so I've switched all my information I don't know if you watch that introduction video or whatever's going on um, I get a gym membership normally for you know vehicle dwelling so that I have a place to you know go to the bathroom and have a shower and all that good stuff and I also like to work out so having a gym membership is good well I'm going right over here right down the street from the job so I'm basically like five ten minutes from the job done uh, okay so we just got a membership all set up I'm all showered up I'm feeling fresh I was gonna work out but then I decided to to get off a little bit early or get out of there a little bit early and come and record these vlogs um, yes I have a crazy beard big old white thing not that anyone just brought that up but I was looking at it right now going damn dude the things getting crazy like I said two three months things are changing when things change this beard will be gone okay that's when you'll know things have changed <laughs> well obviously things will change and you'll know too so all right let's now that you're all squared away let's start this vlog we gotta get something to eat. I am starving. Let's go. So I was thinking about going to this place called No Bones Cafe. It's a vegan restaurant. They have this um, buffalo tempeh that is just excellent. And I haven't been there in over a year. So that's what we're doing right now. Um, I am working now in the union. So I'm, I'm a working vehicle dweller. I don't know. <laughs> It's kind of funny. We'll maybe touch base on that on a whole nother episode. But uh, I thought it was funny today. Somebody came up to me and and noticed me from um, the the work vlogs that I've done, the drywall. I'm like, oh man, you're not hanging houses anymore. And I'm like, whoa, how weird is this? And like, I watch your YouTube. And I'm like, that's crazy. Oh man, it's so much nicer. Last time I had a trailer attached when I was doing all this. 
Oh, it was such a pain in the butt. We gotta do something different, that's for sure. We're not doing a, a trailer this time. Uh, we'll figure something out eventually. And well, we've arrived. Here's no bones. Um, I gotta start pretending like people aren't on the street so I can start talking to the camera while I'm doing this stuff. Lately, I've just been filming and thinking I'm gonna do commentary later. And then I'm watching the video going, why didn't I say anything? Now I gotta do commentary? <laughs> Crazy. All right, let's enjoy this meal. How's it going? Pretty cloudy out here. Sun's obviously gone down. The clouds have come in. It's not too bad. Alright, so that was cool. So what we're going to do now is going to grab some uh, food for tomorrow. Because I don't really have like a refrigeration all set up, obviously. So I'm going to get some food ready for tomorrow. So I have my lunch and everything all set. And it's uh, cold enough at night that, you know, it's like a refrigerator. I'll just take it to work with me. No big deal. And uh, yeah, so let's go. Let's go to the store, I guess. Well, good morning. I'm out here on this little like spot that I've got or that I found a long time ago. It's in kind of like a treed area. It's super dark out here as you can see. So um, it's nice and dark and quiet. It's a good combination for some sleep. Um, last night I didn't sleep that great just cause it's kind of uncomfortable sleeping in the back of my truck to tell you the truth. So hopefully we'll have something changed by the end of this week cause I don't really care to do that too much, you know. I have a pretty nice bed in my trailer, and I enjoy that bed, so. We'll have to figure something else out in that series, or in this series, but I just thought to keep you updated. I'm waking up right now. Literally just got up. That's why I look so tired. My nose is all stuffy. I'm about ready to uh, head down to the gym. Let's get showered up and ready for the day. Um, start time on this job is 545. Let's go. Interesting vehicle. We got a Trader Joe's right here. I'm just about leaving the gym. Day two. How are you guys all doing? How's your week been so far? We're gonna go get something to eat. I think I'm gonna hit the uh, um, Whole Foods and we'll go and get something from their uh, war hot deli. All right. All right, we're out here at the Whole Foods Market. I just thought I'd turn you around and say what's up um yeah all that good stuff i think i already mentioned this morning damn it was it was a rough night's sleep uh, i don't know if i'll even put that clip in the video but damn um it's been a while since i've slept in the back of my truck um i've got this basically got water toilet paper pillows my bag uh that's basically my uh back seat you know uh, front seat, I've got basically groceries uh, and a laundry basket full of clothes. So I'm, I'm obviously not really like super prepared for this trip this week. That's why I just kind of threw just everything in here that like I may need or may not need. I don't know. Uh, next week, I don't know. I'll probably end up doing this again one more week, which I don't really care to do, but I probably will do just because I don't really want to spend the money on a hotel and I'm not going to rent a place. 
Um, the ideal is to maybe get like a cab over or some kind of little camper or something for a little bit and just do some stealth camping for a little bit. And then, like, like I said, maybe I meant, I don't know if I mentioned in this video, but in about three months I'll be, there'll be some changes going on. Maybe we'll change our vehicle, do something different between the truck and the trailer and whatever. Maybe we'll downsize into something that's just like self-contained one, one unit, you know? Um, yeah, there you go. There's basically rant. Let's go into this place and get some food. I'm hungry. What time is it? Um, it's still early because we get off so early. It's probably like maybe 5 o'clock. It's raining out here in Seattle, as you can see. Go figure. Wow, rain in Seattle, right? And, uh, yeah, that's it. Let's throw the old hoodie on. <laughs> Look at the little shell I got. It's pretty dope. There's my Under, under, uh, under Armour sponsored this video. Let's go. Not sure why I decided to come down this way. I thought it'd be cool to check out Sculpture Park and get some views of this uh, Ferris wheel and some of the loading ports or whatever the port of Seattle over there. But uh, I'm stuck in traffic. So just figured I'd tell you that's what's up. Um, I don't know, we might just skip that for another day. Uh, it's raining out, not much going on, so. Got groceries and everything for the morning. Pretty simple. There's my back seat. Just some blankets and pillows and whatever. I'm gonna kick it up right now and turn it into a little bed or something like that. So let's do that real quick. You're not gonna really be able to see this too well. But uh this is it. This is my cool little camping experience. My All right, we're up, we're ready for work. You know how hard it is to get dressed in a damn truck? Woo! Not exactly uh, the easiest thing possible. Uh, threw some pads down in the back, made it a little bit more comfortable. Uh, I'm gonna be getting some kind of like air mattress or something for that back for maybe this next week or something. And then, uh, like I said, we'll end up upgrading eventually. But um, I'm out in my special little spot. As you can see, it's dark as hell out here. No one else is out here. It's quiet, peaceful, nice. Rained all night. Fell asleep. It was fine. Um, it's not getting cold enough out here. Like it's 40, 48 degrees right now, you know. <laughs> in Idaho, it's like 23 in the mornings and stuff. So that's your update. We're heading to work. All right, talk to you in a minute. Peace. Okay. <laughs> Damn busy, uh, busy day. Almost forgot to even uh, include you in my little travels. So obviously we didn't do anything yesterday. It's been kind of like, oh, here I am. Now I'm going to bed. Here I am. Now I'm going to bed. But uh, I'm actually gonna take you somewhere. <laughs> We've got a little bit of sunshine, a little bit of clouds. We're gonna come down here, and maybe we're just gonna go walk over this uh, some kind of like bridge, walking bridge. All right, I'm at that damn walkway I was trying to get to. It's probably really windy. I'll maybe do some narration at this point. Look at that. The sky's beautiful out. I don't know exactly what that is. Some kind of, I don't know. If it, it, I don't know what they carry holding those, some kind of silos. Well, they obviously fill the trains up. Well, this is like the entrance of the park, kind of. Well, I think we're like midway goes to the right and also goes to the left here. A lot of people biking and running. Let's make it over here to the water edge. Just kind of hanging out down here. You guys all know what that is, the old space needle. There's a bunch of sculptures down the way here. Uh, I don't know how much farther I'm gonna go. I probably could have just parked down there, it would have been easier. But it says we're walking for a little while, a little ways. That was pretty sweet though. 
bummer it's gonna get so it gets so dark so soon. Can't wait till it starts becoming like spring and summer. It's a lot easier to get uh, footage all day long. This is probably one of my favorite burger places out here. It's called Red Mill. They got a stack of bacon they have back there by the cook. You can see from the counter. I got a single burger with blue cheese and bacon on it, of course. Dude, that burger was super bomb. And now I came up to this place called like uh, Metropolitan Market. It's kind of like a grocery store, but they got a lot of really good food in there that they cook too. Mmm, look at this. Cookie. It's like huge. It's fresh. It's warm and stuff. Mmm. So good. Just thought I'd share that with you. Look at that. Fresh chocolate chip cookie. Um, look at that. Let's go to the bluff real quick. And uh, enjoy the rest of our night over there, huh? For whatever reason, it's too dark for you guys to really see this, but we're gonna find a good spot and get some of the city lights in here or something. Well, it's pretty dark right now. Doesn't really want to pick it up. But we are basically we're right there the other day. Oh come on man. Get get your stuff together here, guy. Well, I don't think it's going to work out too well for us. There, that's a little better. Um, that's the Pier 51 or something, I think. They got the um, carousel. I don't even know what the hell that is. A Ferris wheel. And then we got the whole city sitting there. Uh, I can't point out the space needle you know, from here. I just can't really see it, obviously. But, yeah. We're out here on the bluff. Pull you back. You really can't tell. And that's all water out there. Well, and that's the end of this uh, vlog for the week. Heading back to Idaho. Got to see what the boys got done up there. Left them in charge of the, the business. Um, we'll see how it works out. I don't know how, how long, uh, what kind of trial period we're giving them, but this first week was pretty rough, that's for sure. So maybe we'll give them a mulligan. I don't know. Hey. Like, share, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know what you like, what you dislike. I'll see you in the next one. And peace. Peace.